Good morning guys, assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh, halal family, welcome to the channel, hope you guys are having yourself a wonderful day, guess where I am, I'm an antique racist store, I gotta get some more nasi goreng, um, spices, and also the drink, because we really really like their drink the last time I had it, so I'm gonna pick some of those up, and they got more andumi, Chicken curry, which one's this? Special chicken. And me insta goreng. Wow. So you got a bunch of stuff to choose from. I gotta ask I, I, I have stock only no, 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 no. The only ten percent. Oh not the lot? Yeah, not a lot. Okay. Uh, and up this man, there's, there's more. Do you have any more drinks? Like the tea drinks? No. No more, eh? So uh stuff. okay, no problem. So no more drinks, just uh, the noodles and uh, the spices I guess the yeah. only thing. So give me a minute guys, I'm just gonna grab it and then we'll come. Alhamdulillah guys, just finish it. Auntie Grace's got uh got some uh, insta indumi, um just the packets of noodle and I uh, got uh, some randang uh, spices as well as nasi garang spices but uh, she didn't have a lot of stock she said that they, she's going to be getting it inshallah by uh, beginning of october end of september so uh, couldn't get any drinks there was no tea no nothing so just ended up basically getting the, the spices we're gonna uh, try to make some at home but now we're going to actually a another uh, food truck i think it is in Vancouver, they sell uh, Indonesian food and they got tempeh. So we're gonna go there and try uh, tempeh and see how it is. So stay with us, we'll be uh, heading there now. Just made it to downtown, getting close to the food truck. This area is called the Olympic Village. And as you can see here, the name of this place is called Canada House. And that's where the Canadian athletes used to stay when uh, when uh, the Olympics uh, were here, Winter Olympics 2010. So this is where all the athletes initially used to live. And then once the Olympic ended, then they started selling it. So like the road or the buildings called like Athletes Way and uh, some of the buildings are called like uh, Canada House and other uh, countries where the athletes were uh, staying. And uh, that's where the food truck is. So. Alhamdulillah, it took us actually a while to find the place because where their first address was, they weren't there. Then we searched their uh, Instagram page and found another address. Uh, they weren't there. Then I just started driving around and uh, we saw them. So they're all the way at the end. So there we go guys, Sanpan Indonesian Grill. You guys let me know what Sanpan stands for. So they got volleyball, roti wrap, gadu gadu salad. And then they got sarabaya, citrus sauce, peanut puree, Sumatra, spice. They also got iced coffee, and let's look at the other side. I think same thing on the other side too, so we're gonna check with them. I think they said their tempeh is halal, but I don't know if it's actually vegetarian or uh, not. So the truck looks pretty cool. Sanpan Indonesian Grill. So great news, actually we found out that the chicken is halal. So I ended up getting two bali bowls with chicken. And then I also got a Jakarta jelly and an Indo iced coffee. So we're gonna try the drinks too and see. Alhamdulillah, I hope I didn't get too much food this time again. Uh, but sounds interesting. Bali bowl and uh, comes with rice, veggies, meat. So the chicken's halal. And then got some drinks. Wanted to try both of them. One is Jakarta jelly. Another one is the iced coffee. Um, so yeah, let's see how it is. Now we just gotta wait. We're order number six. Oh wow, I, I ripped it. Look what I did, sanitize it. Order number six, they're just right down there. And on this side, there's park for the kids. You know, they get to play. There's like a 
water fountain or something there big area right close to downtown Vancouver and they got a really really good spot finally find uh, an Indonesian place here in Vancouver guys so alhamdulillah you got a lot of stuff here you got uh, a spice ooh, ooh. a spicy let's try the rice by itself mm, coconut rice and then we got chicken satay fried onions I think peanut sauce on top let's try the chicken oh wow this chicken is actually way better and more tastier than the one that we tried um, a couple of days ago from the Malaysian food truck. Veggie is like a little sour, a little sweet. I think whatever dressing that they put on top of it, it's really good. So they got green salad on the side too, which is basically green beans lettuce carrot reddish half a boiled egg and then some potatoes I think boiled potatoes mm, I like that potato it's not soft and it's not hard it's like al dente it's like a little chewy but it's good this chicken is really good yeah. Oh wow, it's like crispy, smoky a little bit, and lots of flavor. The rice kind of has a little bit of like sweetness to it, but I think the proper way to eat this is to also put the spice because the rice is a little sweet, so you want a little bit of a heat. Mmm, there you go. Now I know what you guys were talking about. That I need to find the Indonesian restaurant. Because those who make authentic food, this, the flavor is going to be different. And this is really, really good. I love the flavors. I'm gonna get super fat if I come to Indonesia because I'm gonna be eating this kind of delicious food every day. So I need to lose a lot of weight before I come. That way if I do gain weight, they'll let me into it in the airplane. If not, they might get me to buy two plane tickets. <laughs> Here we got the jelly, which I think said Jakarta jelly. I'm gonna try this one, see what it is. Pretty good. Mm. Wow, that's sweet. It's nice sweet, it's like perfect. It's not too much, it's not too little. And then you get like a taste of coconut. Mm. I could just drink that anytime. And this is the iced coffee. So I'm just going to shake it because as you guys can see, the bottom is still black, a little bit like dark. It's ready, let's go. The iced coffee is <clears throat> a little bit more, a little, just has a bitterness, but I think they have put the perfect amount of coconut milk as well as sugar that it's not too much. Like it's just kind of like medium, it, it's not overpowering, but you just get like a hint of coffee, the darkness, which is, you know, that that's how you want it, right? You don't want it too sweet. At the same time, you don't want it too bitter. So you want to balance it. And that's what they got here. Can't go wrong with this, guys. Super good. I love it. 
I'm gonna continue finishing this. All right, guys, just got home. So we ended up actually coming home because the little one was tired and she needed to go to bed. So um, I'm just ready now to uh, rest as well and uh, start working on the reaction videos for you guys. So if you guys like this video, please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And if you like me to react to any specific video, please put in the comment section below. As always, guys, thank you very much for all your love and support. I hope you guys have yourself a wonderful day. Take care of yourself and your family. And inshallah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care and we'll see you there.